You can relax, I'm not going to play an instrument, and I'm not going to sing. Um, I am going to remind you of some things that you knew and maybe have forgotten in this last year. I'm going to read a list, but you could do me a favor. When I'm reading the list, I'd like you to filter the things that I say through a screen, and I would like that screen in your mind to be four or five of your favorite Bible stories or Bible verses about God's insistence on having his way, his insistence on redeeming us and the relationship he has with us, on the fact that he won't be mocked and he doesn't sleep, um, and that he will not be deterred by anything that happens on earth. There's a bunch of stories, and you know what they are, so filter these things through that truth. By the grace of God, Turner Christian Church saw seven people baptized into Christ and 14 placed their membership here this last year. God provided a new associate pastor, Jack, for our church in spite of the global pandemic. Through the giving of our congregation, God provided abundantly for the needs of our church so that the church budget was met every month through the year. God enabled us to outfit the preschool with its own bathrooms. God. Uh, willed for us and then helped us, uh, helped a group of you all uh, renovate and reorganize and reinvigorate our library program here at the church. God used us to reach our community through hundreds of welcome bags given to new residents, financial assistance for water bills, benevolence for the needy families at Turner Elementary and Cascade High School, aid to the Marion County District Attorney Victims Assistance Fund, and the Turner Fire Volunteer Association Fund. God used our church to provide a place to worship for the Gates Community Church of Christ during the wildfires and then to send them a check for more than $3,000 to help them rebuild. Through the work of our food bank volunteers, God has fed 63 families, 215 individuals, every month this last year. God used this church to provide 612 Operation Christmas Child shoeboxes for missionaries in Ecuador and the Philippines and Christmas gifts for 12 families of prisoners through the Angel Tree Ministry. God helped us find ways to adapt to the many challenges and uncertainties of 2020, including 14 weeks of online-only services, Zoom room, small groups and classes, Sunday evening picnics, drive-in services, and sing-alongs. Our family ministry team was able to find creative ways to continue their ministry through online vacation Bible school, COVID-friendly trunk or treat, at-home Advent kits, and caroling at Turner Retirement Homes. And then, as if all that was not enough, he reminded us of his love and faithfulness by sending us our new friend, Charlotte Holmes. We recognize that everything good that happened in and through this church in 2020 was done by God. And so we take a moment now to give him thanks. Pray with me. Father, our praise this morning is an offering. We bring it to you and we hope that it, that it brings you pleasure. We are so grateful for your... Uh, your willingness to keep your promises to the Turner Christian Church in the year 2020. We are so thankful and in awe of and humbled by the opportunity to partner with you in turning your kids back toward you here in Turner. What a beautiful thing, and for us to be able to witness it from right here in the front row is just an unspeakable pleasure. So we are so thankful for your faithfulness to us. We give you the glory, and this is our praise, and we hope that you receive it this morning the way we intend it. In your son's name, amen. <laughs> 